it's Marta and welcome to another week's KMVB K-pop music video breakdown and this time we're going to be talking about twice cheer up turn up baby turn up baby don't go here let's begin by saying that i really really like the song and i'm talking about how cheerful it sounds how upbeat it is how happy go lucky it's awesome it's super fun and i really 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 like it things that I like besides it being so cheerful and upbeat and everything like the vocals are pretty darn all right I think that it's super cutesy and I think that it's very well divided so I think it's really really cool that all the girls get their moments to shine I particularly like the that is adorable I just can't stop doing that one <laughs> so the chorus is cheer up baby and I don't want to say it because I know everybody's going to be like, nah, how dare you? And I, again, I really, really like the song. And as usual, I don't criticize anybody for like singing anything in another language. However, do, do I think they're saying cheer up, baby? I mean, the lyrics tell me that they are, but it doesn't sound like cheer up, baby to me. It sounds more like every time I just hear shut up, baby, shut up, baby. I know they're not, but that's what I hear. Now, the lyrics, if you've been keeping up with a little bit everything that's been going on, you might know that there's been a bit of a controversy with what they're singing about. It's mostly because some people say that it's a little bit sexist, eh, a little bit chill. It's a song, enjoy it, okay? You can enjoy the song and just be, okay, well, the lyrics are a little iffy, but whatever. They're talking about, um, you know, cheer up baby because they actually do like you they're just acting like they don't and like uh no 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 i don't like you when they really do because they're girls and this is what girls do and you should be a man you should be like a real man and understand that this is a girl attitude and you should cheer up because they actually do like you even if they're not showing it not my favorite message in the world, but at the same time, I don't hate the lyrics. I'm not like other people who have been like, oh my God, this is the worst thing ever. No, okay? I get what they're saying. I do. The idea is a cute one because it's kind of is true. Like girls do like to play games, let's not lie. But at the same time, the whole, you should expect this because I'm a girl, that's not cool. Don't, don't, don't encase all girls in that. Be a man, be a real man. No, not cool either. But other than that, like I said, the song, I really like it. Moving on to the story of the video, the concept. So just like uh, with some other videos, it's the story is there, but I like that everybody gets their individual story. So we start with a bunch of girls just gathered around a table and they seem very moody and angry at me. And they're like, ah, eat this and leave me alone. And I'm like, well, why are you so angry? And then there's a cameraman, which is the best thing ever because he's an actual cameraman. His head's a camera. And he's like, um, okay, well, we're gonna cheer everybody up and we're gonna do something with like taking selfies with the filters. And everybody gets their own filter, which is the magical filter of wonders. I wish my camera did that, like just one filter. And like even your background completely changes into something that like according to the filter. So we have the horror movie filter. I'm assuming that's what it is because she was talking on the phone at first and then it's like all dark and it makes me think of a horror movie and then she's also terrified apparently I'm going to murder her as the camera is approaching her and she's like no! You got the what I call the schoolgirl, especially like it reminds me of a Japanese schoolgirl because of all, like all the cherry blossom petals falling down in the uniform and just the, the, the way that it's said. I mean, it just reminds me of a bunch of, of, a bunch of animes. Then we have the magical girl filter, full with like the batons and the curly bun hairs and all the unicorns and the, and just, it's magical. It's magical girl. We have the glamazon filter. It's classy. It reminds me of old movies and she's getting her corset tightened up and she's all fanciful and beautiful. Then you got the western filter like literally western filter hat guns boom 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 the tomb raider filter i guess it's tomb raider i also you could also call it the badass filter and you got the eastern filter which is like playing the uh, traditional instruments and she looks gorgeous and then we got the bubble filter i love the bubble filter it's wonderful and then of course we've got the cheerleader filter which is where they're dancing and doing the chorus and everything else 
I think they're phenomenal. They are so well done. It just like one background. And you know exactly where you are. You know exactly how you're supposed to be feeling. As for the outfits, I think the piece revealed, oh my God, she looked so pretty. Just like all traditional style. It's so pretty. I also like them. Just everything. The outfitting and the setting and the story because the individual filters is so well done. Uh, I also like the little hairstyle with the magical girl. As for like their uh, cheerleader outfits, that's a wonderful, it's a wonderful stage outfit anyway because you know they're all matchy and stuff. And I like the Japanese schoolgirl outfit as well. Moving on to the dance, it is so freaking adorable. I really like it. I like the whole I'ma fish you and pull you in. And now we're just gonna go. It reminds me a little bit of the girls' generation, like the O dance. Maybe it's just because they were dressed up as cheerleaders there as well. Probably that's why. But like the old, those early dances, like G and O, like a combination, just the whole, like maybe G because of the whole. It's very cute. That's pretty much it. As for my favorite moments, my top three, three favorite things of this video. So, number three is the dance. We were just talking about it. I think it's adorable. I think it's cute. Like I said, I like this so much. Number two is the magical girl filter. It's specifically the moment where she's right into Pegasus and she's like, Rah! I like the magical girl filter. It's like the most fun to film in. And my favorite moment is the very end of the video when you discover they're not in these magical places of wonders, but they're all in the kitchen. Just full outfit in the outfit that they were like, so they're just playing dress up, but they're all like by themselves and they look insane. And that is great. I mean, they might not be crazy. They might just be play acting, but I like to think that they're crazy. And that is why that's my favorite moment. What was your favorite moment of Twice's Cheer Up Baby? Let me know in the comments. Do you kind of agree with the uh, lyrics? Do you like the song still, even though the lyrics are a little bit iffy for some people? Like this video and remember to subscribe for more content. And you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram, like me on Facebook, find me on Tumblr, and I will see you around in Wonderland. Stop moving. Oh shit. Did I just hit Damon? I'm sorry.